Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back. Today we're talking about formatting the SD card on the Mavic Pro. So today we're just going to go over some really basic functionality and just talking about formatting the SD card and how to do that using the DJI Go For app. Let's say you're out in the field and you need to format the card and you need to do it right there on the fly. Um, this is how you do it. Now I'm going to touch on a couple of other things as I put the rig all together. Things that are basic, but when you first get into one of these, are helpful to know. Why do I have a Polar Pro plug from my USB to my phone to connect this instead of the micro USB to phone? Well, when I first started experiencing trouble with connectivity to the phone and the app, there's another video here that you can watch regarding upgrading iOS and app updates and those types of struggles. This was a solution to that problem in addition to app updates. Um, this, I really like this, the connectivity is solid. I, I plug it into the USB port into the bottom and I plug this into the phone, which I'll show you here. When you first unpack your rig, and you're putting it together, you are going to want to do a couple of things before you get to that point. Number one, you're gonna take this protective piece off and don't forget to remove this stabilizer, the gimbal stabilizer. I always put it back on for storage keeps it in position, keeps it from wiggling around, especially if I'm carrying my backpack rig and that whole thing. But that needs to be freed so that it can do what it does. Okay, first thing is that you're gonna notice when you pop on a battery, but if you pop it on and simply press the button, these smart batteries are just gonna give you an indicator of how much juice is on it just by pressing the button. This one's like got two and a half because it's blinking on the third. So how do I get it to power on? Well, so once you put the battery on, you press it quickly twice. The second one you hold down for a couple of seconds and that's the magic sound that you want to hear when it powers up. So you've powered up your drone, connect your phone to the controller. You press this once, it'll give you your battery strength on the controller. You press and hold it the second time. You'll see it says connecting and it'll make that sound and then you let go. And then now it's communicating and connecting the signal with the drone and the controller and it will go through that. And then what you're going to do is you're going to launch your DJI Go 4 app and allow that to connect and as, that, as that's connecting, you'll see it will cycle through its menus, ask you to update if there's any new updates, verify home position, etc, etc. So here in this screen, basically what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to press the settings menu, which is just below the record button. And that pops up this menu where you can scroll down and you're going to scroll down towards the bottom where it says format SD and follow the prompts. It'll format your SD card while in the Mavic. It'll give you the confirmation that it's formatted. You click OK and you're ready to fly and to capture that footage. And there you go. I mean, it's really that simple. 
sometimes when you have something new or you don't have the practice and trying to read manuals can, can be challenging. I totally get that. I try to read through them as much as possible. Sometimes they're hard to read. Sometimes they're not easy to understand. So that's why I make this video. It makes it simple. Hopefully this video was helpful for you. If so, please consider smashing that like button. If you're not subscribed, consider hitting that subscribe button down there and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified anytime a new video drops. Thanks for watching and until next time, cheers.